Hello folks, welcome to Sherwood Park Toyota located at 31 Audemars Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. Today I'm going to be showing you this new Toyota Highlander LE. Now the most notable features on the LE is its backup camera, you also have your lane departure alert, and your auto headlights. Now I'm going to go through a couple more features on the inside and outside of the vehicle just to get you better familiar with this new Toyota Highlander LE. Let's get started. Now a couple of the exterior features that you will see on this LE model is its daytime running lights and then if we take a closer look at your front bumper you're going to see your plug-in block here and then over on the side you have your 18 inch aluminum alloy wheels. Now you also have your integrated signal lamps as well as heated mirrors, foldable mirrors, vortex generators and one of the nice things with the vortex generators they actually assist with the aerodynamics of the vehicle as well as help with fuel efficiency. You can find them on your tail lamps and the color we're going to be taking a look at today is Oulala Rouge. Now to start off with, we're going to be taking a look at your front dash as well as your front seats, just so you have a much better idea of how much space there is. Now you have your black cloth interior seat surfaces, and if we take a look just over on your left hand side, you have your auto headlights as well as your window wiper de-icer along with some space where you can store some coin. On the inside of your driver's side door, you have your mirror controls, window locks, power locks, window controls, both your front and rear windows. Now a couple of the controls you'll see here on the steering wheel include your volume control, scroll function, mode select, you have your voice recognition, Bluetooth, scroll function for your multi-informational display, along with your lane departure alert and your cruise control. Now one of the nice things with this multi-informational display is that you can go through many of the different options on here. So taking a look, you have your range as well as your eco indicator, all-wheel drive indicator, and a sway warning control. But you can also go through your lane departure alert, your messages, you also have your settings menu for your lane departure alert pre-collision system, as well as a couple of other additional features in here, just so you can personalize everything for yourself. Now if we take a look at your center dash as well as your touch panel display, you're going to see a couple of different options on here, including your digital clock. And then if we take a look at the very... Um, the setup menu, I should say, sorry. You're gonna see your general voice display as well as a couple of other additional features. Now, heading into the car menu here, you're gonna see your fuel statistics over a given uh, amount of time, liters every 100 kilometers. So parents, if your kids borrow your vehicle, then you can see exactly how much fuel was consumed at a given time and see how far it actually went. Now, down below here, you also have your temperature control settings with your front, rear, and mirror defroster with your hazard lights. And then if we look just underneath here, you're going to see your traction control on and off, snow mode, downhill assist control, and your all-wheel drive lock, along with your USB and auxiliary and your power outlet. Now, if you have your phone placed on top here, you can actually just pop this open here, and then just slink your cords through the uh, bottom here, just so you can hook it up to the USB and the uh, auxiliary input, just to make things easier for yourself. Now it's mounted to a automatic transmission and if we take a look at the very top here, you're going to see your sunglass case holder for those days when it's quite bright outside while you're driving, but you also have an additional mirror on the inside here just so you can keep an eye on the kids just while you're driving. Finally we'll be taking a look at your rear cargo area as well as your tailgate. Now located on the back of your tailgate you'll find your backup camera just located on your left hand side. Rear hatch is located just underneath your Toyota emblem. And I'm just going to close in on the rear cargo space just so you have a much better idea of how much room there is. Now one of the nice things is you have that 60-40 split rear seat, or third row I should say, so in the event that you do need the additional space you can have it folded down to the floor. But if you want the seats folded up, all you have to do is just pull on the strap that's located on the back of the seat, pull it up, headrests are just located right behind it here. And then if you want to tilt the seat back, just pull on this piece here and tilt it back. Now if you do want to tilt the seats, or sorry, fold the seats back into the floor, all you have to do is just pull on the strap that you would to tilt the seats back, and then push it forward and it will fold back into the floor. Now the other nice thing is you do have that 60-40 split second row seat as well, so if you do need some additional space just because you're moving a couple of things a little bit bigger, then you can have those seats folded down as well. Now located just underneath the floor here, you're gonna find your jack and your toolkit as well as some under the floor storage where you can hide away some of your valuables as well as on your left hand side here as well underneath that uh, pad there. And then this is also where you will access your spare tire which is located just underneath your rear bumper. Thank you so much folks for watching this video today. If you have any questions, please visit us. We're located at 31 Automall Road in Sherwood Park, Alberta, Canada. 
The phone number is 780-410-2455 or please visit our website at sptoyota.com to get us by email. Once again, folks, thank you so much for watching this video today. If you have any comments or any additional questions, please leave them in the comment section located down below. Other than that, make sure you have a great day and I hope to see you next time.